up welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is Bailey and in today's video we are doing something so super exciting so we are going to be taking Ellie to PetSmart and TJ Maxx for her very first time so Ellie is finally fully vaccinated and ready to explore the world and we thought it would just be so much fun to take her to PetSmart and TJ Maxx and let her pick out some toys for her and her siblings they have recently what feels like destroyed all of their toys I swear we only have like three or four and for six dogs that's just not gonna cut it we need more than that so we thought it would be a fun day to kind of go to PetSmart and TJ Maxx, pick them out some toys, and make it even more fun, bring Ellie and you guys along for the ride. So if you guys enjoy this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up as well as hit that subscribe button down below. And without further ado, let's just get into the video. What if the world had more of your smile? What if the wind could spread your love? What if your sweetness could reach everyone? There'd be no wars. Mm. Maybe the birds will sing about your heart. Maybe the trees will whisper the word. Maybe the sun will spread your joy to the ones who lost their hope. She's gonna just sit in the front with me because we don't have like a dog thing in the back. And she tends to sometimes get car sick. She's getting better as she's gotten older. But car sickness is definitely something we've had to deal with her before. So I'm gonna keep her in the front with us in hopes that she doesn't get car sick. And sorry for all the super bad lighting changes. It is about to get dark outside, most likely within the next like hour or so because of daylight savings. Uh, 4.45 it will start getting dark. He doesn't believe me and the sliding is terrible so we'll catch up with you guys once we get to PetSmart. We're going to go to PetSmart first and then we're going to go to TJ Maxx after that um, and just have her pick out a few things. What if the world had more of your smile? What if the wind could spread your love? What if your sweetness could reach everyone? There'd be no wars.
show you all of this when we get home, but we've got three collars now, one for Ivy, one for Willow, and one for Ellie. And now we're gonna pick out some toys. So I'm gonna let Ellie pick. We got this one, then this unicorn. Ellie, come here. Which one? Come here. Oh, you're gonna come to me and bypass the toys? Look. Which one? Which one? <gasps> you want that one? Okay, we'll get you that one. How about that? Grab some of these bully slices because our dogs used to love them. And what flavor is that one? Peanut butter. Peanut butter. Okay. Yeah, we don't do chicken in this house if we can avoid it. Oh, is that good? second stop TJ Maxx you excited let's go pick out more toys all right so we are now at TJ Maxx we're going in she did fabulous in the first store so fingers crossed she does just as good in here because I think it's gonna be a little bit more crowded in here than it was in PetSmart seen any of the puzzles we've gotten here before but they do have puzzles here as well they don't seem to have any today but they do have the little slow feeder bowls different cute things they also have these little memory paw print ornaments look how cute that's super cute the dogs would literally never cooperate for us for that and we're gonna get this I like to get these here because they're like $7.99. I think we might grab those as well because we've had these before and they love them. So many good options here and cheaper options as well. So like these, these are like the knockoff Benny Bones that we really like. So a bunch of good options. That's why we love it. She's enjoying herself over there. Ellie! Come here. Ellie is sitting down. She's tired. 
She got so much attention and she did such a good job. Literally, this dog could have easily been a service dog or something like that. She just has the most perfect temperament. I got a clip of someone petting her. I didn't get her face. She literally did not jump on anyone. She greeted everyone so respectfully. She was so nice. She was not overwhelmed once. No panting, nervous panting, like nothing. She was freaking fabulous. So now we're gonna go to Chick-fil-A and get her a little celebratory small vanilla ice cream. So for being such a good girl. So we're gonna do that and I think Matt wants Chick-fil-A for dinner. I did cook something, but I guess we'll just eat it tomorrow for dinner. But, um, yeah, she did so good. We got a ton of goodies, like the large pickle, some stuff from TJ Maxx, and I don't know how great our vlog footage was because Matt is definitely not... I'm awful. The best. No words. Oh, my God. I didn't say you were awful. Look at her. She's so sleepy. He's just not the best vlogger, and that's okay. So I'm not sure how much of the vlog content is gonna be decent, but we're gonna put it all in. Um, I don't care. If you wanna eat the tacos, we can eat the tacos. If you wanna eat this, we can eat this. It's whatever you wanna do. So, okay, we're not going to Chick-fil-A anymore. We're now going to Dairy Queen to get her a little cup of vanilla ice cream and we're gonna get a blizzard because that sounds good and Matt decided he does actually want to eat my tacos. So, we're doing that. Ellie's relaxing and chilling and I'll show you guys once we get her her little ice cream reward. All right guys, we just got back from Petsmart and TJ Maxx, but we ate dinner. So we've been back for a little bit, but I wanted to sit down and do a haul to kind of conclude this video. Ellie did literally such a good job. She was so sweet, so friendly, but still not overwhelming. Like she didn't jump up on anyone. She walked around and just greeted everyone so sweet. She sat for us. She didn't try to pull me all over the store. Like that dog, I think I said it earlier, could literally be a service dog. Like she is amazing. Her temperament is just fantastic. She's the sweetest thing ever. And I could go on and on about how great of a dog she is, but I feel like you guys already know that. But yeah, she's just amazing. I was so proud of her, especially for that being one of her very first like bigger outings um, to a public place with all those people and other dogs. She didn't bark at any other dogs. Like she would get excited and wag her tail really um, hard. But once I told her to sit, she sat. Like she just literally did phenomenal. She's the best dog ever. But I wanna kinda show you guys all the goodies we got. So we got a few different toys, got quite a bit of toys, some treats. Um, and then some collars as well. So I'll start with some of the treats we got. So I got, and I think this is all of them, let me find them. I just grabbed these like $1.99 little chew toy treats um, on our way out. Um, I got six of them, but there's only five in here. Where's the other one? Hope, oh, there it is, I was about to say, I hope we didn't get, this is off of PetSmart, we do PetSmart then TJ Maxx. Um, I was about to say, I hope we only got, didn't only get five, because that would be bad. So. I got these just as a treat for the dogs to have. I'm gonna probably give these to them tomorrow when I go to work, because I have to go into the office tomorrow. But Matt doesn't. I don't know. They'll get them eventually, so I just grab these. Ellie seemed to really like them. And then as far as toys, we got them this Frisbee. So it's the Chuck It Rugged Flyer. They have the Kong um, red rubber Frisbee that they literally love, but they've started to like chew the edges off. Um, and I thought it'd be fun for them to have another one. So. Really fun little frisbee. Got them two different soft toys, or no, three. So they're probably gonna end up chewing these up, but this one says it's for firebiters, so it's long lasting. So invisible, invincible squeakers. So hopefully they won't chew this one to pieces. They love these little like appendages though on all these toys, and they will like chew on these until they come off. But we got these, we'll see if that holds up. This is not gonna hold up, but it says it's tough and ballistic toy bite shield protection for shredders and go-getters. So hopefully, but I just thought this little unicorn was so cute. You can't even see it because it's the tag, but it's a cute little unicorn. It's got like stuffing right here, but then like the little legs that crinkle like that, which our dogs really like. And then a good squeaker, so this toy. And then they're gonna shred this one up like within seconds, but it was only $9.99 and I love the little Christmas pickles. We got one last year when they had it. Um, and Jagger was literally obsessed with it. He carried it everywhere and this one crinkles. But the issue with like things like this, there's now we have the poodles and they literally shred everything. So this probably won't last long, but it was fun. It's fun. 
I think it's cute. And last year, Jagger literally ate the hat off. But this one's a little different, but I know he's gonna be so super excited. So we got this toy. And then lastly, at um, PetSmart, we got some collars. Um, we also got these little bully sticks. I forgot to mention those. Um, our dogs really like these. I forgot to mention these when I was talking about this other treat earlier. So got that treat. And then we got these collars. So I got this little cute cheetah print one for Ellie. So that's going to be Ellie's new collar. And then I got this one for one of the poodle girls. I don't know which one I'm going to put in this one. So this one's strawberries. And then I also got this really pretty green one for one of the girls. So I don't know. I feel like this one will look good on Willow and this one will look good on Ivy. But I don't know. We'll have to see which one I want to put on who. But I got those three collars because the poodle girls still are in their collars that came with them when they came here and I just wanted to get them a new one. And we also need to get Ellie, Willow, and Ivy new tags. Um, really need to get that but I just haven't had time to order them and I don't like the ones at PetSmart. I like the little gold circle ones so I just need to order them. I actually did order them and then the person canceled the order. I guess they just weren't in, like making them anymore so that kind of sucked but then lastly we went to TJ Maxx and we didn't get much at TJ Maxx. They really didn't have as much as I thought they would um, but they did have really good options for like stuffed toys and leashes like just didn't have stuff that we needed but first I got this Bam Bones Plus in the bacon flavor no beef flavor. I'd always love these different types of cho uh, chew toys and then and they can't shred them and then we just got one of the like Benny Bone impression like it's not the real one it's called Bam Bones oh, they're both Bam Bones so we got the Y one and then this little one they love these it keeps them busy these do not shred and get ruined super easy so they last a lot longer around here but yeah that was all we got with Ellie on her first trip to PetSmart and TJ Maxx like I said she did amazing and we just had a really good time so I'm going to take all the tags off of these toys and give them to the dogs and I'll probably put in a little clip of that here got all the toys look at them She got the frisbee. Did Ivy, Ivy wanted the unicorn? What's what's Willow wanted? Okay. Willow wants the Y bone. What do you want, Indy? No, it's from Harlow. She stole the pickle from Jagger. Harlow wants everything. Where's Ellie? Oh my goodness. Ellie wanted the water. Oh my god, that was so fun. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, make sure you give it a thumbs up as well as hit that subscribe button down below and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Bye.